What up world? I'm Braddy Lynn and this is another Project Zomboid adventure. During this series, I will attempt to build the ultimate maxed out character, filling every single box in the attribute tree, forming a fully maxed out terminator of a survivor. Meet Max O'Toole. She is a former mole drop police officer and these are her traits. Wish her luck. She is going to need it. Well, we made it, but it wasn't easy. This is what I call the storage unit saga. At the end of it all, maybe it was worth it. All right, just about six o'clock. I think it's light enough for me. Not enough for me to walk out this door. I've heard a zombie outside this entire time. Is it just you? You've been making all kinds of noise, dude. All right, let's head back towards our vehicle. Let's, I think I'm just wanna try and clear out um, that area that is the storage area. It sucks because when I was over there a few days ago, there was uh, no zombies. Okay, dude. Oh, I've died over here before. <laughs> oh, bye. All right, what do we got going on? Three of yous. You want to try the... Oh, I don't have it on me. Oh, I think I put the spears in the truck or something. Alright, let's go, bud. I went down. I'm panicking. Ooh, I want those overalls. Okay, so I want these overalls because, because, because I actually read that overalls have the most um, spots that you can um, do tailoring to. So when you add padding and all that, um, it's ideal to level on overalls because it has so many places for you to add padding. So I'm glad I found those. And then maybe once I get them all fixed up, I'll have a sweet new outfit. Okay, let's see what the situation is. We got two stragglers. You guys want to come over here? Yeah. Maybe we'll check on that spear. Oh, here's one. Here's one with the butter knife. Okay, let's try this. Oh man, you're gonna get yourself in a big problem, lady. Woo! Nice. I think I'll take that glue. I'm not sure if that helps me with repairing stuff. I kind of want that flag. Mm, nothing we need. Okay, this place is a bus. I thought this place might have a uh, water cooler. I do want that flag, though. Alright, how are we doing down here? Okay, we just got a few, really. Okay, if I can pull these guys just around the corner. Are you guys the only ones over here? Oh, this might be good. All right, come on, guys. Bring them around. We'll do our dirty work over here this way. And then we'll kind of do a sweep around the area and just kind of make sure there aren't too many zombos. Okay, I'm going to have to switch here. We got to switch. You guys coming? Alright. I think you got like a knife in you. There we 
There was a zombie up here. It looked like he walked off. Okay, this guy right here. Nice. And then we got just a... F oof. We got a bit of a group. Bit of a group. Now we got a couple here. Pull them down this way. Come on, guys. Yeah, we leveling up, baby. Oh shit. Let me see if I can't get them to come around. This way. Yeah, come on. Oh shit. Now we got this person. Alright, come on. Doing my best. Doing my best. Uh. Uh, bye. See you later, people. Oh shit. What's wrong with you? Two, three, four, five, six. Oh, we got a few. I don't think I can take them, though. I think I can take them. I think I can do it. I'm a sweaty mess. I think I can do it. Okay, just move it along here. What up, yo? walk it off a little here. Let's walk it off a little. Yeah, come here. Oh god. <laughs> bring him this way. We're gonna bring him this way. I don't know why I always miss that. Oh god, what's wrong with you? Alrighty. Bye. Oh no, there's still more. Oh no. Oh dude. Oh, I got night. What up, bro? I'll take your watch. Okay, gaggle. What up, gaggle? And then what's that over there? Oh no, we're gonna find out. Come on, guys. Let's do this thing. Out of here! What is wrong with this fucking thing? Oh no! Why are all the zombies back? Why? 
Bring him out in the road. Run! <laughs> Come here, bullshit. Alright, I got to go rest. Oh god. Yeah, let's go, dude. We gotta go. No, oh, they're all around my car. Shit. Abort, abort. I'm gonna have to stay somewhere else. Oh no. Alright, we'll wind our way around and find us a house to be in. Shoot, I'm just like worried. It's been like, I don't know, four or five days since the last helicopter event. So I'm like getting worried that it's going to happen tomorrow. Oh man. After fighting all the zombies, I was tired, very sweaty. I'm not saying the M word. And overly exerted. Is that even a word? So I found a safe little spot to hold over for the night. So that I may return to the storage units in the morning. Okay, let's try this again. Oh my god, there's more zombies down here. <laughs> Alright, let's let's try and do the spear here. Do the spear action. Noise. Hey lady, you want some of this? Ow! Hello. I'm gonna stick this in your eyeball. Oh, dude. It's a shame that it breaks so quickly. Okay, so that was those guys. Alright, what do we got going on over here? Alright, we got a group. We got a group. Anything down here? No. Alright, come on then. Onesie twosies. I like the little slice action. Oh shit. Nope. Oh, Jesus Lord. With a nightstick, baby. I think that was it for spears today. Mostly because I'm out. I'm out of them spears. Alright, we're getting in these things today. I'm not messing around no more. Come on. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. <laughs> Too good. Oh, my God. Come on. One, two, three, four, five. Come on. And then I swear to God, I'm getting in this thing. As long as the helicopter event doesn't happen. Oh my god. Come here, dude. No, I do know. Okay, so up over there, there's a bunch of zombies. So hopefully, when we pull the truck in over here, we don't draw them all over. But I think we're clear now. Oh no, we're not. Shit. Alright, this is what we're doing. Let's see if we woke up the frickin' neighborhood with zombies. Are they coming? I don't think so. 
I don't think so. I think we're good. All right, so I just got to get the pickaxe out and bust open these doors. Wow. Oh, no. <laughs> we got another one. Are you coming over here, lady? Uh, let me try and get these guys where they come over to me. Oh, damn it. She tripped me up. All right, we're going to hop the fence. Run. Run. Come here. Okay. I'm not even going to bother looking at what y'all got on. Wow. I'm okay, though. I'm okay. I'm okay. We just need to dry ourselves. Woo! <laughs> okay. Crowbar, baby. Crowbar. Noise. Looks like you got a little shotgun. I'll actually take that bulletproof vest. Thank you. Um, we'll put the shotgun on. I've got like three or four shotguns. At the moment. What y'all hiding in here? Are those mannequins or zombies? Oh my god, that freaked me out, dude. Okay, what is in here? Ooh. We got some metal sheets and things. Right over here. Sheets. Guitars. Okay. Empty. Okay, this might be promising. Ooh, some planks. I do want to grab those. Some clothes. Gravel bag. Oh, a jack and a lug wrench. We do need those. We need those. I'll take this muffler thing too. We need that for mechanics. Boots. Okay. Okay, that was a pretty good find. We need to go inside and see what's going on in there. Let's put off. Let's put the mechanic stuff in the back of the truck. Once I rummaged through the last end unit, I took a look on the inside. It was slim pickings all around, really. Not much to write home about. The best find was the lug wrench and jack I found in the outside units, and those are going to be super helpful in loving mechanics so that I can make sure my truck is in tip-top shape for joyriding in the apocalypse. If you stuck with me to the end, it means you probably liked the episode. Go into the like button. Also consider subscribing and join my crazy camp. Thank you to my new and current subscribers, and as always, until next time, bye-bye for now.